this is our new robot manager uh, 1.2 I'll show you how to program an easy part or an easy part a part this one here you have different options here you have the product that's already done you have all your parts or the last use so I'll take this one here and I choose myself these two are uh, available for my uh, little part this one is the expert 80 uh, so I'll choose this one here mm, there we are so the part is here you, you can still uh, walk through the part again if you like uh, you have some details here about the part you can have the simplified or the uh, complex geometric if you have um, lots of holes let me go to the cell uh, I need to choose a gripper I can use this one it's a simple part so I use a simple gripper small one um, here you can also add and um, hide 3d objects <clears throat> normally the standard stuff is, uh, is like this so you can see everything really well then you create a program so here we have the gripper again you can say where you want to pick up your parts it's and where you want to um, put them down it's here in this uh, shoot then I don't want a double sheet detection my parts are stainless and they're nice uh, and clean and cut and they don't stick so here we are create a program so now we make blocks there's one block for every robot program module it's here one two three four five six seven blocks these two are the bending part of the of the part and these other blocks are home position pickup referencing on this table here you can see the tables and this is the shoot and then we go back to home so you, we need to go through all these uh, parts here you can move your part uh, let's, let's move it somewhere here and then at the top you just start on the left side we're at seat position i need to do three this is one of three so this is the next one this is in my reference table and i need to check to see if uh, if it falls in this corner here if there's a collision it's red so easy to uh, to understand and i have this aligned workpiece now we calculate with gravity friction inclination and everything how the part drops in this corner this is fine and then here we um, put the part down on the chute maybe a little bit down and, and also here again if there's a collision so we're done here now we need to decide on the gripper position so you can see here before pickup and that is this is the effect when I move here it also straight away moves here and so I can see sometimes you know uh, when, I, when I move the robot this doesn't work anymore so there's a collision this is a collision after the movement so I need to find a movement where I don't have any collisions like this this is fine next one um, move a little bit more to the middle like that you don't really have to do that but I always you know try to uh, to put it in the, what I think is an optimized position uh, what we calculate is most of the time good enough uh, there we are that's okay and then next step is the is the path so now everything is orange here at the bottom and we need to get all that green so the easiest thing is to just go uh, check and now it tries to add all these blocks together without hitting anything so we see two little red dots and if you if you go to a dot like this it you, it will show you the collision there it goes through that thing uh, you can see that's stupid but you know it's uh, pretty difficult to uh, to calculate all these paths and what we've done is we have added already this little block we've inserted that this is the collision. and then we have this block and there's also one here so easiest way is to calculate autopath and now we put points in space around that collision and try to avoid it um, normally after one time they get green we added a point here so now everything is green and you can already now run the part completely like this picking it up Go a little bit faster so that's it you've made your robot program it's finished now what you can do still is uh, add a little bit more uh, autonomy you can do stack patterns like this this part here you can say okay i want to uh, i want to uh, double it 